gonna be meeting with one of my good friends, Kevin. And uh, he is the uh, co-organizer for the third annual Champagne Runch. Uh, it's been super successful out here in Long Beach, out in Orange County. And uh, we're gonna talk some, some logistics about the upcoming Champagne Runch. <music> So it's gonna be a, an amazing collaboration. Um, it's on our third annual. We're looking for some big brands, some big sponsors and partnerships along like champagne, along uh, food, athletic wear. Like we're talking about Adidas today. Corner of Broadway and Lime here in downtown Long Beach. And uh, one of my buddies just painted this and um, we're gonna do a little collab. So we're gonna put a nice little quote up top there. And it's uh, gonna be by Ray. And it's gonna say, I never wanted to be famous. I always wanted to be great. Live inspired. Five miles, 52 minutes. And resistance, a deal falls apart. No, not supposed to happen. I'm in traffic. No, nope, not supposed to be in traffic. You get a lawsuit. No, nope, not supposed to get a lawsuit. And so now what happens? Does the resistance of a lawsuit, does the resistance of a, of a canceled escrow, does that affect you later? Absolutely. Does an argument at home affect you on the listing presentation? Absolutely. So does a flat tire affect you on the listing presentation? Yes. So if I were to say we have to draw a line in the sand, what we really have to do is practice acceptance from where we're at. Out here in West Hollywood, uh, one of my good friends, Eric Michael, has a show tonight called Introspect, so I'm gonna check it out. Beach. Today is uh, Saturday, April 28th. We have the Wall Olympics a little bit later today. So this is by Roshi. And uh, right now I am in Belmont Heights and one of my friends, Maureen Neely, she put on a, an art and architecture uh, stroll in the neighborhood. So this house behind me is the Cooper House, 4216 Colorado. Let's check it out. <laughs> The Werner Residence is 233 Prospect. Uh, kneel down real quick. Say what's up to my dogs. What's up, dog? Built in 20, original owner was a member of the Ebel Club, but we can't get anybody to... You're telling me about it. You're like a little tour well, guide. Well, you've got to hear. <laughs> Both teams were 
wonderful, love the color schemes. For the team to win today, I gotta give it to Roshi and Daniel. Oh! I didn't know I was watching right here. A lot of people didn't know there were a lot of things tonight. Give yourself a round of applause. We just, we just set that. Here we go. Am I right? We still have another. Massive success. Eric, how was it tonight, bro? Oh, dude. That was the best. Dude. It's been envisioned for so long, and it's happened. So, Keith was kind enough to let me inside his house and showed me his 1959 Paul Tay. Paul Tay. When was it built? 1959. 1959. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. All, all the woodwork is still original, the ash wood. Wow. Because of the, uh, the top. In the old days, they had the trash cans with those kind of lids. Yeah. Wow. Has records in it, still works. A place called Outrageous Contemporary up in LA. If it's still open, I don't know. He saw we found down by the library in Long Beach. Main library, they were having a mm -hmm. art exhibition. Okay. This mobile is by a student of Calder. Calder. Who started the uh, mobile. Just a great overall conversation, and that's, that's what it is. That's what it is.